What's up, guys? It's your boy, Gemini Healthy One, back again with this week's edition of Skincare Sunday. If you're watching this on my YouTube channel, can you like, share, subscribe, and click that bell? Click the bell so you know when I'm doing new skincare posts that you guys might be interested in. So I thought this week I would talk to you guys about something that commonly bothers a lot of African American men. What is that? Well, it's actually those razor bumps that guys tend to get. Yeah, those nasty razor bumps that look like uh, all crusty and, and, and nasty under there. So there's actually a really simple, easy way to get rid of those. And I found that out quite a few years ago. The easy thing that you need to get rid of those razor bumps is you need to actually exfoliate. Yep, exfoliate. Doing a scrub. Scrubbing gets all that dead skin and residue off and then you need to moisturize. Yeah, moisturize. Even if your skin is oily, you need to moisturize. And oil does not make you oily. Only if you're dehydrated. When your skin is dehydrated, that'll produce more oil. So you need to moisturize the skin. What that does is it conditions the skin so when the hairs actually grow back out, they can actually come out. But when you tend to shave and you don't moisturize, or you use alcohol on your skin right after you shave, you make the skin hard and dehydrated. So when the hair gets ready to come back out, it can't. It turns back around, and that's where you get that irritation. So you need to exfoliate, and you need to moisturize. So what I do is I always do an exfoliation the night before. Then I moisturize my skin. I get up the next morning. You get a really good shave, and then you moisturize again. If you like using alcohol, you can shave, use your alcohol, and then back it back up with the moisturizer. That's going to condition the skin. The more you do that over the next 30 days, the skin will become soft. So when those hairs start to grow back in, they actually come through so you don't have that irritation. So again, you're going to exfoliate and you're going to moisturize. That's how you're gonna get rid of those razor bumps. That's the problem that we have all the time. We use all this alcohol or we use tin skin. We think, oh, but I'm killing all that bacteria and that's drying it up. It's drying it up, but it's also making your skin hard, which is causing the same problem to happen all over again. I discovered that problem years ago and guess what? No razor bumps. So again, guys, if you wanna get rid of those crusty razor bumps up under your neck, you need to exfoliate and you need to make sure that you moisturize and you'll get rid of those. Thank you guys for tuning in. Please like, subscribe, share this with a friend and leave a comment below. If you have some other things that you want me to talk about, I'd love to hear from you. You guys make it a great one.